What's up, guys? CJ back once again for Kung Fu Night, and it is time for more It's Always Sunny. We're up to season four, episode two at this point. For starters, hit that like button. It lets me know you enjoy the content. Let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, we're going to see what they have in store for this episode. Season four, what happened last time? Last time we had the, <laughs> the Manhunter episode, the Cannibalism episode, lots of fun. Links in the description for Patreon tiers if you want to get ahead, if you want early access, if you want full and uncut reactions to It's Always Sunny, anything you may miss on the YouTube side. Uh, all that's available on Patreon, y'all. But I'm not going to waste too much time. I'm going to get right into it. How are we supposed to scale back our energy costs when you are filling this generator with gasoline? Yeah, bro, since when did you start running the bar on, on a gas generator? About a week ago. Oh, shit. I've been doing it for about a week. Mike, yeah. as the brains of this organization, I should have made this decision. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. oh sorry, I don't know about that one. I'm the brains. Uh, I'm sorry. I've always been the brains. Well, yeah, of course I'm the looks, but I always thought of myself as the brains and the looks. He thinks of himself as the brains, everything. Charlie, wild card. Looks, brains, wild card. Think about it. The A-team did it. Scooby-Doo did it. <laughs> Not Scooby-Doo. Oh, shit. Yes. I came up with a plan. Lay it on us, bud. It involves pulling up our bootstraps, oiling up a couple of asses, and doing a little plowing of our own. <laughs> Not gay sex. Oh, okay, because okay, that's okay. what it sounded like. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to solve the gas crisis. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> Not what I expected at all. Hmm. I should be really interested, because I feel, I feel like I'm not educated when it comes to the gas crisis. We'll see. We'll see where they go with this. That's terrible. That was my, that was my wild card face. Yeah, All right. What message are you trying to send with that? <laughs> that he's crazy. I think con constipated. You're gonna take a dump? Or? Seriously? You, In two days, some Muslim cultural center is about to get a giant check made out of our cash, and we gotta get that back. Listen, oh, Bruce this is back. Is giving our money to terrorists, and we gotta prove it. <laughs> Whoever said they're terrorists, man. Yeah, I had a plan. I was gonna eliminate everybody else and be the only surviving heir. You mean you were gonna kill me? I, I don't know. No, yes. Maybe I was going to. Maybe I was. The point is moot now. I'm really focus on one tiny part of what I'm trying to talk about here. It's a very big part of your. Uh, it's just a couple of words. It's the biggest part. Because no it's him. And, him. <laughs> and Bruce and me and help. <laughs> this is what the gas prices will be. He's drying. And what are those? Yes. Uh, these are gorgeous women with heaving breasts. <laughs> heaving. Why? We sort of thought we'd be speaking to a man today. So. Yeah. Is there any way that we could talk oh, to your oh, boss? No. Because you look back in the background, there are two other women working there and just one dude. Vastly majority of women here. I take you in the back and change your mind. Or how about we all go in the back and have great sex? What are you doing? <laughs> oh. oh. How did we get here? Okay, so, why don't you decide? Yeah. Which one of us do you want to take you in the back and bang you? Hey, he's bouncing him. Let's go. <laughs> Wait, this is just some dude. Hey, wobble it. Wobble it? Yeah, wobble it back and forth. Wheel it, wheel it. All right. That's it, that's it. Now get it. Oh, and it's funny how they're just wasting more gas. Hey, assholes. Hey, I think that guy's in happy endings. Hey, what the hell is that? Yeah, that's totally him. D keeps her life savings in her sock drawer. That's a dumb place to hide it. She's an investor now. Wow, they're just filling a fucking trash can with gas. I don't, it's gonna stew up inside me. It's gonna drive me crazy. Stop now. You can't do this. Come on, Only cars. Oh, jeez. All right, well, mild card, do your thing. Oh, oh Jesus. <laughs> not that, not that. Jesus Christ. So he's definitely a wild card. Hey, we're actually losing money driving back and forth from that gas station. All <laughs> you burn up products. Plus, I have swallowed a good deal of that, and it's just a damn waste. Yeah, and, and gas has gone up. I got a plan. That is the goal of the gas like industry, right? Gas, it's all yeah, about the don't money. Worry, bro. Get receipts. I can't do that. You're trying to return you it now? You can't do it or you won't do it. Both. Not yet. <laughs> That's a baby monitor, Frank. Yeah. You're planting a baby monitor? Yeah. A lot of people are bugging their babies these days. I thought Frank was supposed to be the smart babies one. Babies can't be trusted. 
Capitalism at work. This ought to show the sun. Oh, of they're opening a gas you know station. Exactly Holy shit. I count how much gas is going into the car. Uh, I know how to count, dude. I'm not okay, you do it. You do it. Because <laughs> I can't speak well, to say I don't free market what... 101. You got to have customers to have a working business, right? So what the hell? No, 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 no. no. Let me please reiterate my strong opposition Trust to this Dennis. idea. I know what I'm this doing. This is really unsafe, dude. Do not blow that fireball. Oh, shit. That was kind of awesome. Yeah, I think the the message here is that, I don't know, maybe in real life, we do so much to waste all kinds of gas. All right, whatever, fine. Oh my god, this is gonna be interesting. I mean, how has he been They're just listening to some random dude. Is that a baby monitor? Oh, shit, I got it. God, is that a Muslim guy? He's getting in my face. Oh my god. Holy shit. <laughs> He's just fucking up this man's car. Alright, well just let me do the talk. Well, I feel like you gotta at least talk with a southern accent. Oh, I'm not man. gonna talk in a southern what? accent. It's bad enough that you wore this stupid disguise. But we're oil men. We would have southern accents. Yeah, but we don't need bolo ties and stupid yeah, just a couple old men in from Dallas and well, <laughs> we're itching like a hound to give you a something you want. <laughs> There's a lot of oil and gas business in the oh South. We ain't gonna take no for an answer now, you hear? Okay? So don't <laughs> be hear? making me sit my associate on me. He don't take kindly to know. Oh, so, no. Can I, I say, I say, that's just damn. I say, I say. <laughs> 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 Guys, I think it's time we cut our losses. I'll tell you what. Oh, the generator. <laughs> no, not the generator. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> Oh no! I'm waterboarding your sister because she's Holy escalating shit. the plot to kill us. Dad, help me! Why the hell would I help you, D? You're so plotting to kill me? No! Help! Shut up! Is that a great fan? And he's just fucking like pissing like, like nothing's man, going on. In some dude's car like five times. It was amazing. <laughs> you guys took the van. I thought it was some Muslim guy. And Frank is the muscle. <laughs> well, what's D? She's the useless chick. Oh, oh shit! Out of everything, that was the one thing that they all like agreed on. It was like, that makes sense. Oh no. Guys, why are the brakes working? Because I cut the brakes! Wild car, bitches! Yeah! <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> He's a fucking madman out of here. Oh, this poor guy. Just sitting in his, his fucking living room eating some Cheetos. Holy shit! <laughs> uh, wrong place, wrong time, man. No shit. <laughs> yeah, definitely a wild episode here. Um, it's, yeah, I really liked how they just kind of depicted the whole uh, gas business in, um, I don't know, a number of different ways. They... A funny thing is I'm in Dallas myself and you know, there's tons of oil and gas business going down here I like Charlie's get up. It's funny how like all throughout the whole episode. They're just Wasting gas here and there with just you know uh, The stuff with the gas pedal and they're just like revving it and using a fucked up car I believe if we were at right now in like the energy industry we could go away from gas um but that's not what's like profitable. And I think that's just kind of the whole, uh, pretty much what they're trying to call out this whole episode, right? And just how like, you know, fucked up that process is and how it's all just about making money and, um, you know, things like that. We had this stuff with, I figured Bruce was gonna be back obviously, but no, he wasn't just some random unsuspecting dude living at the wrong place at the wrong time. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, this dude just wants to sit out here, fucking eat some fucking snacks and chill. But nah, his car is getting fucked up more and more, man. So, <laughs> um, Mac in a towel. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know what more I can say about that, man. This dude is out here, uh, you know, stealing cars and shit, just <laughs> making himself available to be, uh, <laughs> He's giving Frank a reason to, to racially profile. 
Um, so, speaking of Frank, this dude was just, this dude tortured his not daughter. Frank it, it just overtly tortured someone this episode, so, but uh, here we see it firsthand. D was on the receiving end of that. Jesus Christ. This might be list worthy, I think. I think, I think very much this is list worthy. So far, I'm, I'm definitely putting Frank at the top of the list for the uh, torturing. Charlie is the most innocent, you know? I can't, I, I'm gonna put him at the bottom of the list for now. Let's see, he's, he's, he's siphoned some gas. Um, you know, he didn't steal it, they paid for that shit. Yeah, they opened up a legal business, but whatever, you know? Um, D, it's intended to kill her whole family slash not family, depending where, I don't know, Dennis and, uh, Frank fall on those lines. So D was plotting to kill some people. All right, we'll put her up there. So maybe second on the list uh, Mac Let's see here Maybe maybe maybe, uh, maybe since this was such a circus of an episode Maybe Mac can join the circus and do some fire tricks man because that shit was pretty sick that he was doing at their at their makeshift biz business um Dennis was an, an accessory to uh, D's torturing. Maybe we can throw him up there. So since Dennis was an accessory to that, we're gonna put him third on the list. Uh, then we'll throw Mac on there as well. Uh, and then Charlie bringing up the end of the list. But yeah, I think that wraps up my thoughts for this reaction. Another wild one, y'all. I'm gonna close this one out. If you enjoyed this reaction, leave a like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell so you know when the next It's Always Sunny reactions are coming out. Next episode, I don't know what it's called. That one's available on Patreon, depending how you're watching this. Um, you have full uncut reactions on Patreon. Links in the description. And have a good day, y'all. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.